U.S. Air Force claims to have built sixth-generation fighter jets. According to the service budget document, GAD's main attributes include improvements in survivability and persistence across various military operations. While the U.S. military is still working on some issues with the Lockheed Martin F-35 Joint Strike Fighter, efforts appear to be underway to develop a next-generation fighter jet. The U.S. Air Force is secretly designing, building, and even flying prototypes of the future fighter aircraft. We've built and flown real-world aviation demonstrators, and we're breaking records in doing so. Will Roper, Air Force Assistant Secretary for Acquisition, Technology, and Logistics told Defense News in an interview a few weeks ago ahead of the Air Force Association's Air, Space, and Cyber Conference. We are ready to go and build the next generation of aircraft in a way that has never been seen before. Few details were shared about the jet, which is part of the Next Generation Air Dominance NGAD, program, the Air Force's effort to develop a family of connected air warfare systems. This group of systems will not only be piloted aircraft, but will include unmanned drones and other platforms that can operate in the air, in space, and even in cyberspace. Details of this sixth-generation aircraft are briefly scarce. Roper did not disclose how many prototype aircraft had been flown or even which defense contractors were involved in their manufacture. He also did not reveal when or where the mysterious flight took place. There are no details on whether it is manned, optionally manned, or even unmanned, or whether it has stealth capabilities. We pursue the most complex systems ever built and tick all the boxes with this digital technology. In fact, we didn't just tick the box, showing something truly magical, he added. The NGAD program first started in 2017, but is largely conceptual. Just this month, Air Force officials even said they were prototyping the technology. Work has included modeling and efforts to explore important hardware and software technologies. Current prototypes can serve as demonstrations of technology that can be used for risk reduction efforts or to prove key concepts, suggests the drive.com. According to service budget documents, GAD's main attributes include improvements in survivability, lethality, and persistence in various military operations. Air Force's fiscal year 2022 budget request requires approximately $1 billion in funding, the Tasks and Goals report. That's up from $905 million in 2021 and 413 million dollars in 2020. The program is expected to cost an additional 6.5 billion dollars by 2025. As the Air Force moves forward with NGAD, it could be another challenger to the F-35 and F-15 EX programs, especially as this comes after the U.S. Navy seeks to acquire a sixth-generation warplane to follow the F-35C. Temporarily called the F-AXX, also largely shrouded in mystery, although it will replace their F divided by a minus 18E divided by F Super Hornet. Given the ongoing problems with the $1.5 trillion F-35, it may be that the Air Force and Navy are wise to explore other options. <laughs>